Jesus, it's hot today. G'day, beer lovers. It's your old mate again here. V. B. Ed. I'm going to confess something to you, and that is I'm a real tight ass miser. And uh, I'm always looking for ways of saving money. And uh, over the years, I've discovered all of these little tips no one else is aware of, of saving money. And I reckon I save hundreds and hundreds of dollars every year. But hey, it's your lucky day because I am going to share them with you. So um, I've got to put, I'll put this little video together. And uh, oh yeah, Beryl's going to be along a little bit later on as well. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And uh, we're going to be showing you ways of saving money. So uh, just sit back and uh, look, times are tough these days. Uh, people are battling to make ends meet. So uh, seriously consider implementing some of these, some of these money saving tight ass tips that uh, Beryl and I are going to show you. You're going to be blown away, guys. I'll catch you a little bit later on, okay? Hey, this is a good one. People's birthdays, Mother's Day, Valentine's Day. You know when you've got to nick off up to the local florist and spend 10 bucks to buy a bunch of bloody flowers? Hey, don't bother. Just, just go to the local cemetery, that's what I do, and you, 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 no one's looking, just uh, nick a bunch of flowers somewhere. And uh, hey, your loved one never fucking knows where you got the flowers from. My wife doesn't know where I get mine from. And uh, the people here don't give a shit, because they're all dead. So uh, I reckon you'll save hundreds of dollars every year by doing this one. torn up and thrown in the bin. There you go. Perfect. You're going to absolutely love this one, guys. Well, it's like this. You know how at the end of the day when you're drinking beer, it really tastes like piss, doesn't it? Well, drink your beer twice. That's what I do. I'll give you a demonstration. Empty beer bottle, okay? It actually tastes a bit like Budweiser. <laughs> Sorry to my American friends out there. <laughs> Don't worry about buying expensive leather belts to hold your trousers up. Just do what I do. All I do is I just get a bit of string. Holds the trousers up. You put your shirt over it, let it hang out there, over it. No one ever knows. <coughs> I recycle a lot of things around the house. It'll amaze you. All you gotta do is just wash them out. I'll show you. Yeah, these are sort of the things I recycle. Uh, Glad wrap, give them a bit of a wash. They come out all right. Right, toilet paper. 
give it a bit of a sponge, bit of a light wipe, and you can get another use out of them. No worries at all. Tea bags, just dry them out. You can get another cup out of them. And uh, condoms, yeah. I get my husband's condoms, give them a bit of a wash, and uh, on the on the second time, I tell you what, <laughs> they taste really finger licking. <laughs> Hey guys, th th this uh, little tip here, just keep it between ourselves, you'll save a shitload of money. I'm outside a Sizzler's restaurant, and what you do, you sneak in through the exit door. So you just got to hang around until someone's leaving, and you just catch the door. So you can just sneakily enter the restaurant and just pig out on their salad bar. <laughs> That's what I do. <laughs> Alright, let's do it, eh? There's the exit door. And you just gotta hang around until someone's leaving. Come on, will you? At last, finally got in. Where shall I sit? Yeah, it took me half an hour to get in, but I managed to sneak in. Yummo! I tell you what, don't ever chuck out your fingernail clippings or your toenail clippings. They make really great toothpicks. I'll show you. There you go. There you go. Don't need to buy toothpicks anymore. Hey guys, I've just recently discovered that if you shave the hairs up your ass, you actually use a lot less toilet paper. So that's another good tip. Hey guys, just to finish off, have you guys ever pulled the money out of your wallets and given it a good old smell? I reckon there's no better smelling in the world than the smell of fresh money. What do you reckon, guys? And I'll tell you what, the first fragrance company in the world that brings out a, uh, a male's aftershave lotion smelling of money, hey, I'll be the first to buy it. <laughs> I reckon it'll be a big seller. <laughs> okay, till next time. Just remember, guys, drink sensibly.